morning or evening depending on where you are uh, it's early morning here in LA and I'm just going for a morning walk whilst the temperature's not too crazy this is one of the nicer mornings in LA because it sometimes gets into the hundreds and it's just impossible to do anything when it's that hot and and dangerous so I've got I've got my 20 pound weighted vest on just add a bit more resistance and these walks are something that I like to do at least once a week because it gives me time to think and reflect on what I've done and what I need to do and uh, crazy girl there is, I'm is, being attacked is by flies. she's being at attacked by flies and and she looks a bit mental but anyway just wanted to talk through a typical my typical routine a normal day starts at around 5 a.m. I like to read first thing in the morning um, at the moment I'm reading a book called focus then I like to get out and do some kind of physical activity and today I'm doing this obviously the night before I've planned out everything that I need to get done in the day so today I need to start looking at cast for the film um, and reaching out to people who I think would be perfect for for the roles that I've written a really really intense day starts at three o'clock in the morning and that's not all the time this is where people get it wrong because people go what about sleep what about this what about that if I start a day at three o'clock I make sure I get a couple of hours nap in the afternoon but if that's what I have to do from time to time sometimes twice a week to get the work done before various meetings and stuff then that's what I'll do um, what I want to talk about is, I don't know whether you've seen it yet, but I posted, well I shared a post on Facebook this morning about Keanu Reeves. And the reason behind that is, is a lot of us, myself included, um, a few years ago, we'd be embarrassed when talking about money, weed. We'd look at it as, as something that should be quite private and personal, which to an extent it should be. But um, we were just ashamed of it whether we had a hell of a lot of it, we were ashamed because we didn't want people to think that we were being arrogant or showing off, or if we had very little of it, same thing. The point I wanna make is, it's not money that you should be embarrassed about, and money isn't bad and it's not evil. It all depends on the human, the person who is in control of that money. And now I'm gonna go back to Keanu Reeves. Prime example, he earned £74 million on the film The Matrix and he gave away £52 million of that to the special effects people and the crew because he felt as though they were more important to the movie than he was. They played a bigger role. And that's just one example of someone who has a hell of a lot of money and he's doing great, great things in the world. You know, he's changing people's lives. Another example, Bill Gates, billionaire. But he's putting his money to such good use. Like, for example, finding vaccinations um, for thing, diseases like malaria. World-changing things, you know. And that's, that's the point about money. It's not a bad thing. It all depends on the person who is in control of the money. I apologize about the the quality of this picture. Sometimes the sun goes in amongst the clouds. But yeah, and it goes back to this thing, though you should always be grateful about where you are in life. That's really important to be grateful, but never ever be afraid or embarrassed to strive and want for more. You know, it's it's something that keeps the momentum going. And the more successful you are, and the harder you work, the more opportunities you're gonna be able to afford and present other people. Like the movie that I want to make in December, in 12 weeks, on this 12 week journey. Now, that's not just gonna be me on my own. There's gonna be a director, other cast members, makeup department. A lot of people are gonna get the opportunity to do what they love on set and practice and get better at the craft and we all grow together 
So, just to finish off, because I'm running out of breath, because of this, this vest, just be grateful for where you are in life, but never ever be afraid or embarrassed for wanting more. Work hard and enjoy the journey, because that's what it's about. Catch you later. Bye.